Alright, so today is going to be a double unboxing. Um, this is from E3 Cube Store, and this is from the Cubicle. I will start off with this one. Um, one thing that I found kind of weird is it does have a tracking number on it. But in the order details, it says a tracking number is not available. But probably just saves them time, and it's really fast shipping anywhere in the U.S. So you live in the US, it really doesn't matter. You'll get it within probably, I believe they said their maximum for anywhere in the US is three business days. So that's all that was in the package. I got a cube for you, three by three by four in white, I believe. Open that up, yep, it's in white. It has black stickers instead of yellow. It's black yellow and then green blue red and orange um the green and blue actually look actually I think all the colors look brighter than i expected them to be um first turns it's really smooth kind of like if you've gotten any of the other ones like the three by three by five which i have um they all have the same feeling it's kind of like it's rough but it's smooth uh, especially the center layers. The center layers is really smooth. Um, so yeah, the turning is really smooth. Um, I'm not sure. Uh, no, you can't do a checkerboard pattern since it's since it's even. There's five layers you could, but since it's an even number, you can't. So, um, I'm probably going to lose this to see if it'll help. I think I might know how to solve it. Oh, that's really loose. I just pulled these pieces out. Um, so I'll probably need to tension that. I don't, I don't really think it'll pop during a solve. But it's really smooth. I'll probably try and fix that. The screws kind of make a noise, but I think the orange side is the only one that does that and doesn't always do it even. So I think I already know how to solve it, but I'm probably, I'm going to move it and tension it and try and make it better. That side, the next package is a WIT 2, 2x2, two two. I actually already have one, this is just a version of 1. But the reason I got it is I got it in white. And then cubic card that always comes with the products. I got it in white because I have a stickerless version. And um, I know they're illegal in competitions, and I wasn't sure if they were discontinuing the version 1 because the black one was actually out of stock so I wasn't sure if they were discontinuing it or not and I wanted to get one that was competition legal um, before they ran out if they did discontinue them so I ordered a white one and this one actually feels pretty good out of the box usually they don't feel that nice out of the box but this one actually does I think it might have been pre -lubed. But I know if you get them and they're not pre-lubed, they're like really, really s slow. Um, the turning is really crispy though. If you listen to it, it's like really crispy, but it's fast. I've I've looked at reviews on the version two, and most of them are really, most of them say it's not as good as the version one. So I'm probably not gonna end up getting a version two. Because I have this one, and I believe this one's better. Oops, I messed that up. Okay, but yeah, so the turning is better than I expected out of the box. But I believe it's pre lubed. But I'm gonna go in and lube it myself. Um, it just has standard colors with black instead of white since it's white cube I might order 
a new set of stickers for it, but I'm not sure. So, yeah, um, these are the two things I ordered. Um, one thing I am going to say about this, this was really cheap on E3 Cube Store's site. Um, I think on other sites that I've seen it at, it's usually like thirteen dollars or like twelve dollars plus like three dollar shipping or something you know like three fifty shipping three dollars on e three cube store it was ten fifty so it was like I think about two dollars cheaper two to three dollars cheaper than other sites I've seen on and the shipping was the same cost so it was a lot cheaper and it came in three days I believe today's Friday pretty sure I ordered it Tuesday. Uh, one thing, it is really loose. If you just saw that, I just pulled out the whole row. So I will have to go through and tension this to make sure that doesn't keep happening. But it has a really good feeling. It's smooth just like the other puzzles I make. It's just, it came really loose and I think I saw someone else who said it, theirs did too. But I'm not sure. Right, there you go. So, Q for you, 3x3x4, and a Type-C with 2, 2x2, two, two version 1. 